You're watching UNICEF Television. This summer, one of the oldest cities in the world, Damascus in Syria, hosted the launch of the most important periodical reports that governments and UNICEF produce, the Situation Analysis of Children in Syria. The comprehensive document is the fruit of a two-year-long work of research designed to provide context-specific evidence of how economic and social policies impact children. It is a key advocacy tool to uphold children's rights. The Syrian Commission for Family Affairs, in collaboration with UNICEF, conducted a two-day workshop under the theme Child and Youth Development to draw attention on the results of the Situation Analysis Report. The outcome of the workshop was presented during the launch event. Young people performed in creative sketches tackling three main issues, adolescent participation, peer pressure, and violence against children. We liked the sketches that was performed by adolescents our age and younger than us. They really acted well and were able to express their opinion about things that we were unaware of or didn't pay enough attention to. Young people also prepared a photography exhibition with pictures taken throughout the workshop. They were also responsible for the media coverage of the entire event. Of course we were scared that our work was not going to live up to the standards, but we were excited about it at the same time. The situation analysis aims at being a participatory process in which government, all development partners and civil society organizations participate to ensure a comprehensive analysis is undertaken. The spur of attention the launch of the report created is a significant milestone in improving the situation of children in Syria. This is Natasha Ikoli reporting for UNICEF Television. Unite for Children.